Alrighty! Welcome back. This is Aussie Gamer 17 and we're playing some more of the Technomancer. We're about to head off on the rover. If we look at our quest, it's Finding Earth. Go to the city buried beneath the pole. I think we're getting very, very close to the end of the game, or at least the end of Chapter 3. Uh, this could even be it, so let's hop on the rover and find out. Uh, I'm not going to worry about that uh, missing side mission. Oh, we're going all the way down to the uh, South Pole, apparently. We're here. We're finally here. I hope the beacon of this lost city actually works. For fuck's sake, it's better. Walking to the pole would be a pain in the ass. Our rubber mods have made my baby more sluggish than, well, me after a few drinks. Anyway, I can tell you that we aren't the first to go down this path. You think it's the ASC? Not of course sure, it is. But I can make out tracks, some of which look older than you. Ah, uh, this brings back memories. What else is fucking new? Hmm. Oh, I... I won't miss this, uh, banter. Yeah, I'm 50, 90, 100% sure it's with your father. And you couldn't say that earlier? I... I, I wasn't familiar with the road. I'm sorry. I just didn't realize that this was the city that we... All right, settle down, you two. Let's not dwell on the past. We can do that later, when it's warm. But Scott, if you've been here before, the memories could be useful. How strange. This feels like we're going back in time. I wonder how this will change things between humans and mutants. If we contact Earth, many things will change. And if we have any say, those changes will be for the betterment of all mutant kind. Soothing words, but I cannot help but be suspicious. They may be our ancestors, but I have the feeling they won't be pleased with their descendants. I wonder if Victor's beat us to the punch. If he did... He wouldn't destroy it. He couldn't. He's an egomaniac. He'd just want credit for being the first to turn it. No, what worries me is what happens if he discovers our secret. Either way, it's time to end this. Time for a little payback. Mancer style. Zack, I'm nervous. Whatever we discover could change our lives and everyone's on Mars. Do we really want to contact a planet that has neglected us for so long? If we don't do it, someone else will. And they might have less than pure intentions. True. Better us than someone like Victor. But still, it's such a... precarious responsibility. Okay, with that uh, rubbish out of the way, and yes, that's exactly what I'm going to call it. There is our rare achievement. 110 gamer score. And that is for beating chapter 3, I believe. Didn't really say that, but there we go. Help the... Oh, okay, so we uh, missed a side objective. That's okay. Our current objective is... Whoops. Find the communications beacon and then re-establish contact with Earth. Awesome. And let's check the map. Okay. Gotta go all the way to the end. Let's see how we go. Now remember guys, the uh, the thing to remember... Let me just check my notes. Yeah, here in Chapter 4, there's gonna be some choices to make near the end of Chapter 4. Um, so when we fight the final boss, it's called the Leviathan. After we've fought it, you've got to remember not to move anywhere and make a manual save straight away. Uh, because right after that is wh where the uh, making of these choices is going to come up. And we're going to need to go, go make certain choices and then revert back to the save. So that we can then make the different choices and get all of the... Uh, achievements attached to it so that's what's going to happen with that all right let's grab some loot why not can't help myself um i'm gonna go which way yeah stuff going up there i don't need to go that way i'm gonna i want to head to the objective Oh, 
Oh, I can see some sort of creatures down Move here. Over. Probably belongs to the ASC. The bridge collapsed behind them, but Victor committed. Ah, I see. Keep my guard up. All right, and then how did they get past these creatures without killing them? Well, they just threw something at me. Whoa, 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 whoa. All right, let's just, uh... Why is my screen going funny? Hang on. Let's get this guy. Nah, that didn't work. Oh boy, I better heal. Try shooting him. Oop. Here we go, and zap, zap, zap. Leave Phobos alone, you little what bugger. I've never seen anything like it. Animals that the colonists brought here probably mutated over time. Then we're gonna have to keep our guard up, Zach. If a mutation of a single animal caused this. Then there's likely other types of creatures around as well. Yeah, and why would we be worried about that? Oh, okay, we can uh, force it. I'll go in here. Ooh, what have we got? Victor's men are everywhere. He is quite persistent. Okay. Beacon. Either that or something just as important than secret. They're probably trying to redeem themselves. Think we're just gonna let them Hang on. Here and take it? Hmm. That's too bad. They should have called dibs. Let's wait for this chat. Okay. Let's go take care of these guys. Hey, what is this move? Uh... I've never even used that move before. Alright, let's uh, try it again. Oh, I've got to wait for it to cool down before I'm allowed to use it again. Okay. Zap, zap, zap! Oh, he got me! Shoot! shoot him. No, shoot the guy with the gun. Thank you. There we go. Oh, did he just take down Phobos? Yep. Your turn to go down, though. There we go. That wasn't too difficult. No item found. And you. Um, where do we go? Let me just open this up. I don't want to go the wrong way, so let's... Oh, yeah. Up this one here. I think. Yeah, this will do. fighting each other. Just stand back and watch. Did that do anything? Whoa. Whoops, whoops, whoops. Whoa, get out of here, get out. I can't move. <laughs> Let's just zap away. And do some more zaps. Oh, he's got one of those suits on, so that was almost pointless. There we go. Okay. in here. Don't 
Don't tell me I've gone the wrong way here. I bloody did, didn't I? God damn it. Alright, let's just, since we're here, let's check these. Oh yeah, some exploding traps, that's handy. Alright. Can't believe I did that. Alright, and out here. across the other side. I think this is the right way. Alright, here we go. that do anything? I can't decide if that's worthwhile or not. Ah! Oh boy. Oh boy. Heal. Let's uh, try some zapping. Oops. Did not mean that. There you go. Hey. Up a bit. Alright, now he's dead. Hey. Oh boy. Zap. Oh, got me, you little bugger. Alright. There we go. Oh, they're dead. Okay. Oh, what do you got? Yeah, I'll take it. All right. I just don't think we're going to find another shop before the end of this. That's only issue. All right. Exploding trap. Yes, please. a battle or can I pick up this loot? <laughs> I'll pick up the loot first, I guess. Zachariah Manson. Ah, oh, here he is. I was wondering if you'd make it this far. But I must admit you're particularly sharp. For a mutant. You oh. are too late. I've already discovered the dark secret that your kind has hidden for so long. However, this city. Amazing, isn't it? So full of wonders. A complex of keys to a brand new world. That doesn't matter. You're not gonna live to see it. Ho oh ho! Do you intend to kill me? Like that poor boy Jeff? You won't get the opportunity. Who's Jeff? My men are a little bit on edge after what you did to their comrade. Now if you be so kind, I'm going to pry that last secret out of the belly of this city. The one that will give me a hero's welcome back at abundance. Help me impose a new world order. Farewell, Zachariah. Chin up. Thanks to your hard work, Abundance will now have a bigger, brighter future. Alright, I'm going to start with one of these. And one of these. If I can get it off. There we go. And then I want to kill this gun token. Whoop. There we go, got the gun out of the way, and let's just uh, use some focus. Oh, did that work? No. Alright. There we go. Is that it? Alright. Easy as that.
All right, where did Victor go? This way. Oh, is that him? He didn't make it far. Sorry to bother you, but I'm going to have to stop you right there. I have to admit, even after everything, you are still full of surprises. Such tenacity. Your efforts are futile. Don't you understand? If not me, someone else is bound to reveal your secret. So why not use this revelation as an opportunity? As a chance to promote the corporation that raised you? You're the one who doesn't realize he's playing with fire. And that even tyrants can burn. We shall see. Alright, I'm gonna start by putting some bombs down. And trying to work on... On Victor himself, actually. Get out of here, get out of here. Uh oh, I'm dead. Oh, how am I still alive? All right, and let's heal again. Victor's getting close. Let's heal again. Phobos is stuck down there, not helping me. All right, so Victor's down. I've just got to take care of these two. Oh, this is uh, a lot more doable now. Not even sure how I got rid of... Oh! Ho, ho, ho! Uh, whoops, that was probably the wrong move. Oh, no. There we go. The villain is vanquished. His heart attack, the final blow. Zachariah, you are free. Well, why don't you come up here, Phobos? I was hoping to... Uh-oh, I hear something. Time is short. We must reach the city center. Alright, this will be the boss thingy. Let me just have a look here. Yeah, so we're going up that ladder. What's this meant to be about? Something about the beacon? Okay. Let's head up. I don't think that counted as the boss or the uh, Leviathan that we need to do a big save after. I did just do a save before the ladder just in case though. Um, let's see if we can climb up here. Alrighty, and we can head through here. Zach, wait a sec. Wait a sec. What is it, jump? Yeah, what? We're about to accomplish if we do contact Earth. Living on Mars can be a choice, not a necessity. Would you want to leave? Abandon the red planet forever? Mm -hmm. Not the time to think about it. What would you do? I, I don't know. I think my life is here, but I can't imagine living it without you. But I oh. we are on the verge of history. Come, let's make it together. Oh, that's right. We uh, stuck with her as our romantic choice in the end, didn't we? That's why those words should not come as a surprise. Uh-oh. I wonder if we're going to fight the boss here. Oh, I'm carrying too much now. Luckily, I don't think we'll be doing much more sprinting. That is going to be the Leviathan for sure. Alright, when he's down like that, I try and just use my dagger, and when he starts to move, like this, zap, 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 maybe twice, yes, got him. Alright, now he's gonna spit poison, I reckon. No, he didn't. Zap, zap, zap. And let's fill up our focus. Oh, he got me. Alright, heal, heal, heal. Same again. That was good. Alright. He hasn't been spitting poison. That's weird. He normally spits a heap of poison here. 
because in case you didn't guess it, this is not my first go. But if you're hearing this, it is my last go, so that would be nice. Uh-oh. Get out of the poison. Get out of the poison. Come on. Oh, do not roll into the prison. What are you doing? All right, good. Try again. Zap, zap. Ah, he keeps rolling the wrong way. All right, heal. Oh, he got me. Heal again. Alright, so that's phase one done. Let's uh, heal. Oh, I don't get stuck over here. Okay, good, good, good. Next time he lands like that, we're going to zap him. If we get a chance. Ah, we got hit. I'm not trying to sprint, I'm trying to zap. Ah. There we go. Zap, zap, zap. Ah. Oh, we need a heal. That's priority one right now. Zap. 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 Ah. All right, let's just uh, use a focus. Zap. 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 Use another focus. Uh, I said use a focus. Okay, he's going to put a puddle of uh, poison there. That's the only difference. We usually do another big puddle. So there'll be a small puddle and a big puddle. What's he going to do this time? A big puddle. Alright, miss me. Oh, but, but, but. All right, let's, uh... All right, he's doing a big puddle. Miss me. Oh, how did that get me? All right, heal, heal, heal. Don't worry about anything else. Oh! All right, I'm okay. I'm okay. Yeah, oh, I thought it missed me, but he got me in the end. All right, we're just going to heal. Poison's getting me. All right, here we go. Zap, zap, zap. All right, that's good. That's okay. See, when he does one big puddle of, uh, what you would call it, poison, the other one disappears. Zap, zap, zap. And again. Good, good, good. Oh, don't go in there. Go back a bit. There we go. Yes. I'm going to try this. Ah, I don't think that's going to do anything. All right, go forward, go forward, and zap. Oh, I don't have any fluid. All right. Zapping. There we go. Did that get me? No. Excellent. Let's zap him. We're nearly at halfway. I'm gonna shoot him. Hmm, shoot him. Don't know why I hadn't thought of that. Okay, zap. I find zapping the easiest when it's here. I don't know why. Oh, God. Quick, quick, quick. That doesn't seem to be doing anything this time. Try again. No, but... Okay. Oh, he got me. Zap. 
Alright, so that's that phase already. Oh, I ran into the poison again. Alright, so now we're going to have two little pools. And he will at some point do a larger pool as well. But those two smaller pools are going to stay there. For good. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Alright, heal. There we go. Take this, I'm going to shoot you. And zap, zap, zap. Yeah, shooting seems to be quite effective. Oh, shoot, shoot, shoot. Get, get back, get back. There we go. Take this. That didn't seem to do anything that time. Nah. Alright, that was a waste. Oh, go forward, go forward. Did it poison me? Yep. Let's just do a heal. Alright, boom, boom, boom. Alright, we're getting somewhere here. Oh, crap, the poison's got me. Heal. Heal twice, just in case. Zap, zap, zap. Ooh. Alright, zap, zap, zap. And another one. I want to heal. Oh crap, I need to get out of this poison and heal again. Oh good, good, good. Let's do a couple of zaps. Two rounds. Yes! Alright, next. Woo! Ah! Hang on. Use some fluid. Or focus, whatever you want to call it. I don't think that worked. Hang on. Try again. There we go. Oh, I need a heal. Oh, he still got me. Oh, zap it when you got a chance. I was too slow. Zap. Not roll, zap. Damn it. Alright, heal. Got me again. I'm gonna heal when I can. Alright. Oh, he got me. Alright, I think that did something. That got me. Oh boy. Let's just heal just in case. Yeah, we haven't used too many heals up to this point. Zap. Yeah, all right. Could this be the final phase? I'm not sure. All right, so that's the third pool. So this phase has got three pools. Zap, zap, zap. Zap, zap, zap. Let's quickly use the focus. Oh, he missed me. All right, I'm going to heal. And then I'm going to zap, zap, zap. That did fuck all though. Ah! I'm gonna poison accidentally. Zap, zap, zap. And. Alright, go back and heal. Ooh, heal, heal, heal. What's he gonna do? He's gonna poison this whole area again. And we will heal again. Alright, All right, can I heal again? I want to heal. And zap. And heal. Heal, heal, heal. Oh boy, this is close. Alright, here we go, here we go. Ah! Heal! That didn't work. Heal again. Okay, where are we? Come on, zap him! Ah! Uh, can I do that? Or am I gonna... Alright. Let's, uh, come on, we're so close. Come on! Yes! Woo! Oh, I think we did it. Alright, do not move. Make sure you make a manual save. Alright, there we go. So, 
with your manual save, making sure you've got that before you take a step. I'd say even if you're standing in poison, don't take a step. But that's because I don't know. I don't know if it counts. You know, you may, my, maybe you just need to do a save before we head through this door. I'm not really sure. But save here. And then we'll go on and we'll make our, uh, our choices. Okay, so you could have saved anywhere along here. But there we go. The Leviathan has Surely been defeated. The here. This place is breathtaking. The ice has preserved it well. I doubt anything in here is working though, guys. Ah, look at it. All these uh, terminals are working. Alright, let's activate this, I guess. Initializing search system display. Connection failed. Extrapolating a complete data. Updating search system display. Destroyed. Earth is gone. No way. Wasted, dreaming of a rescue from a place that's nothing but a cloud of scattered rocks. Everyone on Mars, if they hear of this, they'll be devastated. What am I going to tell them? Okay, so this will be our three choices that we've got. Um, and we're going to make a choice, then we're going to revert the save, come back and make our uh, two other choices just like that. Um, what are they? So, not revealing the destruction of Earth and become the great master of abundance technomancers. Revealing the destruction and joining Noctis. Revealing the destruction. Oh, and the secrets of the technomancers. And joining Mutant Valley. Well, I'm going to start with the third one. Let's do that. It's time for the truth. There will be no more hiding. No more secrets. I'm going to tell them of Earth's destruction and reveal the true identity of every single Technomancer on the planet. This news will send shockwaves across Mars, but it's the first step for changing our planet. For the better. Let's go. You can bow your way. All right. And there's our achievement relating to that one. I bet I wouldn't even recognize the young Zachariah Mancer who just earned his stripes. And little did I know that all my choices would compound together and shape the city under the ice. By allowing Volgakov safe passage out of the city, the Resistance survived and thrived, and their support later proved invaluable. Despite my orders, I couldn't bring myself to kill my fellow man, and I let the deserters and their leader go, only to find that one day he would return the favor. I remember letting poor Dave go, understanding he only betrayed me to protect his family. Meanwhile, a more dangerous spy was hiding in my shadow. Despite everything Jeffrey did to me, I couldn't let Nisha shoot him down like a dog. And even in all my efforts to be a good soldier, I was still exiled from Ophir. No matter what happened, Victor was always going to discredit me. Yet my decisions of friends, alliances, would greatly influence the events that followed. The day I left Ophir in a stolen rover was the day I had chosen the people alongside me to become my companions. Through adventure, misfortune, and into battle. Later, I agreed to help Dandolo chase the Vori out of Noctis, for good, cutting them off at the bridgehead they hoped to use to infiltrate every settlement on Mars. And because of that, Anton came close to paying the ultimate price when his men picked him as the scapegoat. But he's not a man you get rid of that easily. By becoming the great master of Technomancers, I've earned their unwavering loyalty but I've also accepted a lifelong responsibility. Since I've left the city under the ice, I've had many young apprentices, and the Order is powerful again, our future bright. Scum keeps the young mutant nation alive and well, and with Phobos' help, he has managed to repel corporations' troops time and time again. And with the incoming surge of refugees, you'd be a fool to bet against Mutant Valley. 
It's destined to become the most powerful force on Mars. Nisha still runs missions for Dandolo, but I can tell her heart's not in it. I think she's beginning to see that her father figure, as charming and caring as he may appear to be, is really a master manipulator that won't hesitate to make less than ethical choices to serve the best interests of his city. I don't mind. It gives me more time to spend with warm, loving, beautiful real Nisha, and less time with cold, calculating, and okay, still beautiful super spy Nisha. And she's finally starting to sing again, and I dabble in harmony. I visit Scott on occasion. He's still probably legally crazy, but he's found a way to use that eccentric energy for good. He treats children in the slums of Ophir, though this time he's not using them as guinea pigs. Vandolo made the most of our alliance, as you would expect. Not this is now ubiquitous. Its merchants have obtained the right to citizenship in Ophir, and are free to come and go from the exchange as they please. The opposition showed its strength when it helped me overthrow Victor, and the people have rewarded them with several seats in the assembly. Now, they promote their same ideals, but do so in a more legal fashion. I'm afraid that with their repeated outbursts, they're on a collision course with the violent side of human nature, but I admire their passion. Mm. Yet nothing compared to my revelations. Learning that Earth was destroyed, discovering that Technomancers were mutants crafted in the vision of the settlers. When I announced the truth, the corporations lashed out. There were widespread riots and revolts, and most Technomancers fled before the leaders of the Alliance could put the pieces together. To adapt to Mars, we had to mutate, or we wouldn't survive. Remaining human had only been an illusion, and one that we had unknowingly mastered. I heard that a few scientists have reproduced Scott's experiments, and I have no doubt there'll be more of us in the future. One day, Mutant Valley won't be the only place a mutant can call home. Instead, it'll be the capital for a race spread across Mars. At least that's what I hope. All right, now we're going to reload that save and uh, choose one of the other endings. Let's do it. Okay, and here we go with the uh, achievements just for finishing the game as well. Let's see if we, uh, we should get them all chained up. There we go. Is that it? All right, now let's go get the uh, remaining endings. Can't sprint, damn it. Lucky Surely it's not far. Is here. This place is breathtaking. The ice has preserved it well. Okay, here we are back at the uh, three choices with two remaining. Let's uh, go to the second one now. I will reveal what we've learned in this. Corporations will feel the blow, but at least for the first time, people there we go. Choose their futures. We can finally hope that a city like Noctis, that welcomes mutants and humans alike, will no longer be an anomaly. Okay, and here we are. Time to make the third and final choice. I uh, didn't show the whole second ending because uh, as far as differences go, they're almost non-existent. So that whole spiel that our character reads out has very little change at all. Um, I'm assuming there'll be a tiny bit of change in this next one. Um, but as soon as the achievement pops for this, that will be our 1000 out of 1000 gamer score. So let's uh, have a look at that once we've uh, done this. Let's head back to Ophir. Promise me, you'll never speak of what we learned here today. with myself if I started a new era of war. Abundance needs us now more than ever to rebuild. All right, and there we go, guys. 1,000 out of a 1,000 gamer score. We have 100%ed the game. I want to thank you all so, so much for watching the series if you've made it this far. Really, really appreciate it. Look, it wasn't the best game ever. I definitely enjoyed the start. It definitely, uh, after that, grew old on me. Um, and by the end, I wasn't even enjoying it too much anymore. But I wanted to finish the series and definitely get that 1,000 gamer score. 
Uh, don't forget something really important so that I can make more walkthroughs like this is that I get some support over on Patreon. Um, obviously, I'm still trying to grow and uh, if you can't support me there, that's fine. Subscribing here on YouTube is uh, a really good way to support me as well. But if you can, for only $1, you can become an official member of Aussie's Army over on Patreon. There's a link in the video description. Like I said, once again, thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please give us a thumbs up. That'll also help the channel. Uh, like I said, make sure you subscribe. Always post a comment if you've got anything to say. I love hearing from you guys, and I reply to all of my comments. And that's it. That is it for the Technomancer, and I will catch you all next time. <laughs>